strong. This is probably one of my favorite items. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, channel. so today we're gonna be doing a fun video. It's November 1st, the day after Halloween. Woo! So if you haven't checked out my Halloween tour video, I posted that last Friday. I'll put that link in the description box below. But today we're gonna do another haul video. Hopefully you guys liked my last haul. This one is also going to be Halloween. It's the day after Halloween haul. So I went to a couple different stores because most stores now, November 1st, have most of their Halloween stuff is on clearance. So girl, you better get out there and get some. Get some discount. That's how I roll and that's how you should roll. If you want to see what I got on clearance, keep on watching. I got my wine glass. I'm going to have some wine while I just show you guys what I bought. I'll tell you the store first and then we'll go down the list. I don't really think I'm going to go over prices. If you want me to, let me know in the comments below. You can just ask me what the price I paid for of what item. I'll just kind of describe what the item is and yeah. Alright, I'm trying not to make this video too lengthy so let's get started. <laughs> Had to have some of that, right? <laughs> Woo, that's strong. These items are all from Target. Everything I got was 50% off. They will have another sale that will go up to 70%, and then they do have another one that's up to 90% off. At that time, most of the good stuff is gone, so I like to go the day after Halloween, November 1st, and just go ahead and get the things I know I really want. The first item I'm gonna show you, I got this really cute like mat that you can put out on your porch. It says, watch your step. There's a little skeleton on it. I absolutely love this. I just thought it was really cute and I actually have a step that you have to step up into my home so I thought this would be perfect to put outside the door. The next item I'm going to show you is the set of lights here. There are many vintage lights. I thought they were super cute. Absolutely love this. You get 20 light bulbs. I already plugged them in and they do get really hot so just letting you guys know if you do end up getting these like they are really hot really fast they're actual light bulbs like, these are real glass they light up orange and it has a black cord this is also from target this is called a skull plasma ball i'll just go ahead and push the button and you can see here isn't that cool i absolutely love it i'll push it again so it, it creates this like really cool like i don't know what's going on in there but I think it's really neat. It was broken right, right here, but that's no problem. I can just use some E6000 and just pop that right back on and just kind of secure it with hot glue around it just to make sure it doesn't go anywhere. On the label here, it reads Electropathic Vessel, Bone Fingers, Spectral Equipment Company, Charleston, South Carolina. So that's kind of just a really cool thing. It's just like home decor. It'll just sit on the shelf and you guys can push it and see the really cool like thing that it does. I think it's really neat. And this is glass. So I thought that was honestly a really good really good deal half off. <laughs> the next item here, I had to have one. It is a, a cat skeleton. The head, you're able to move it whatever way you want. The arms and legs don't move, but I'm not like mad at it. But you can move the tail like up here. It is able to bend. This is probably one of my favorite items, guys. Is it's a bird cage. I really wouldn't say it's a bird cage like by looking at it, because I'm sure if you use it as a real bird cage, the bird would obviously like. I can put my hand through here. Like a bird is gonna obviously fit through there. So it has this cute little bat on the top here, and then you're able to open it like this, and then you can place something down inside, and it has like this purple like mirror in the inside of it. I thought it was so cute, and I had to have it. <laughs> So you could probably put like a candle or something in here. No. You could put anything you want inside here, but I just thought it was like super cute and I had to have this. This is just kitchen towels. It comes with two of them. So you got this one that says potions and poisons. It's a little skull. And then the second one on the back here is just a bunch of skulls. And I just thought they were so cute. Adorable, honestly. This next item are just four plastic plates. But I figured I needed some more plates in my Halloween decor because I only have like three Halloween plates. Now these, I'm going to show you them at the same time. So they had several different like options with these. They are battery operated and 
they're just string lights. You only get six lights, but I thought the bird cages were super cute. They also have like these jars with these spiders in the jars. So I thought those were really cute as well. This was also a super good deal. It says bat's blood. It's just like an apothecary jar. Um, it has like a skull as like the handle here. I did get one of these last year on sale as well. Okay, so the one on the right, I got this one last year. It says Bat's Blood. It was just a clear bottle. I did a little bit of TLC to it. I just added this twine on the top, and then I put in like a gel with red food coloring in it to kind of give the appearance of blood in the jar. And I might do the same with this one on the left. This is the new one I got from Target this year. It says again the same thing, Bat's Blood, but it's a purple jar with a skull on the top. I really liked it. I just thought it would be really cute to add to my collection. This item I'm about to show you, it reminds me from like the Addams Family. It's just like a really cool hand and you put like a candle inside of here. Oh, I thought that was so cool. This, I will tell you the price because there was no price tag on it and they just ended up giving it to me for $3.99, which I was like, okay, because I feel like if I tried to like DIY this, I don't think I would look this good. So this item I just had to have. It says poison on it and there's like a cute little skull. I just thought it was so cute. So that will also be added to my apothecary jar collection. This last item I got from Target, it is just a bucket, metal tin bucket, and it has a purple skull with blue around it as the design across it. It has these cute handles, and then the inside is just purple. But I thought it was absolutely adorable, and I could store some things inside of here for the next year, and then when I get everything out, I can put this like down on the bottom and put like maybe blankets or something inside of it. I just thought it was super cute and had to have it. Okay, the next stuff I'm about to show you is from Walmart. I just got a few items from Walmart, just a silicone mold and you can reuse. This, I thought was a super good deal because everywhere I went, you just did not see this many. This was only like $2.50, I think, and they're pumpkins. Most of the time, when you get silicone molds, they can run between $1 to $5 and you only get like six of the molds. So this one has a total of 24. So I thought that was actually a really good deal. I also got a few different fabric. I got a couple yards of this like purple fabric with these black spiders and white web on it. Figured I could do something with that next year. So if you want to see those videos, then you have to subscribe to my channel so you can see what I do next year. I also thought I had to have this for some reason. This is also in the fabric section. It's not really like fabric, I don't know. It's like this weird mesh. It's very like see-through. So like you can see my hand through here. But it had these cool bats all over it. And I figured I could do something with this. I mean, I could probably easily make this into like a tablecloth or even like curtains would be a really cool thing. So I don't know, I got a big three yards of this material. This item I got at Big Lots. There was, again, no price tag on it, so I got it for a really good deal. So shout out to you, Doug, for helping me. It's this apothecary jar, and it says severed zombie fingers on here, on the label here. And you just press this button, and it lights up the whole jar. So you can see the cool, like, zombie fingers inside the jar. And you're able to take this lid off and then you can switch out the batteries. So I thought that was really cool. This was only like $4. I thought that was a really good deal. This is a heavy duty like jar. And for $4, I mean, and it lights up. I think that's a really good deal. These next few items I got from Michaels. I originally went to Michaels looking for their $4 grab bags, but I couldn't find any. And the cashier told me they should be out in the next couple weeks. Usually they don't put out their grab bags like the day after a holiday. It takes a couple weeks for them to gather everything. So right now they have 70% off on their Halloween stuff. I think their fall stuff as well. So let me show you guys that stuff. The first thing I had found was this really cute like fly and you just like hang it up on the wall like this. This is ceramic so it's really heavy duty. 
This was all 70% off, so it got a really good deal on it. I also came across this really cool item. I just really liked the face. I don't know why, because it doesn't really look like a skeleton, but I just thought it kind of reminded me of like The Nightmare Before Christmas or Corpse Bride or something like Tim Burton-y, and I really just thought it was cool. I liked the eyes on it and the teeth. I thought it was super cool. But you can like either hang it like this, or just set it down and fill it with candy or flowers or whatever you want to do because it's like opened on the top. Um, yeah, this was also a super good deal. And this is this is also ceramic. So these next few items are silicone molds. I got this cool spider shaped ones. They're all spiders, so that way you can make like fun chocolate or whatever you want to do with the mold. Then we have these creepy like the slut or bugs. So these would be like this just reminded me again of like the Nightmare Before Christmas, you know, like these type of bugs coming out of the Oogie Boogie Man. I just thought it was like, ooh, that would be cool for like future use. So I found these mice and I liked that you got 12 molds. That way you can make more stuff at one time. Um, you could just make ice cubes or whatever with these, but yeah, I thought that was super cool. I also found this really cool, cool guy here. The, so this is all glittered, glammed up. You got your skulls on all four sides of this. And then on this guy and this guy, you have skulls like here and on the back side. Okay, the last item I want to show you, I got this really heavy duty skull. It's made out of ceramic and it's like ready to be painted or something. I don't know. I thought it was cool. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. You don't want to miss any of my videos. I post every Tuesday and Friday. Friday are more of my DIY videos. Tuesday I do product reviews, so check those videos out. I'll put links in the description box. And go ahead and hit that notification bell, and you'll be notified every time I post. As always, thank you for watching today's video. I'll see you next video. Bye, guys.